about the Antonov 225. During the 1980s, the Antonov Design Bureau in the Ukrainian SSR of the Soviet Union designed a strategic airlift cargo aircraft. With a maximum takeoff weight of 640 tons, it is the heaviest aircraft ever built, powered by six turbofan engines. The Antonov 225 was created as a larger version of the Antonov 124, designed to transport Buran-class orbiters. In 1988, the only Antonov 225 plane was completed. It was put on hold for eight years after successfully completing its Soviet military missions. After being refurbished and reintroduced, it is now in commercial service with Antonov Airlines, transporting oversized payloads. The Antonov 225 took to the air for the first time on December 21, 1988. The company intended to build two planes, but only one, the Antonov 225, was completed. The second Antonov 225 was built in part for the Soviet space program in the late 1980s. The lone operational Antonov 225 was placed in storage in 1994, following the collapse of the Soviet Union in 1991, and the cancellation of the Buran program. The six Ivichinko Progress engines were removed and stored for use on Antonov 124s, as was the second unfinished Antonov 225 airframe. A cargo liner larger than the Antonov 124 was clearly needed in the 1990s. By 2001, the first Antonov 225 had been restored. The need for additional Antonov 225 capacity had become apparent by 2000, so in September 2006, the decision was made to complete the second Antonov 225. The second plane was supposed to be finished in 2008, but it was postponed. The aircraft had not been completed by August 2009, and work had been halted due to a lack of financial support for the program.